Welcome to our J Crazy News headlines and a special Monday afternoon to those who are watching this news broadcast. Now to my viewers and my subscribers, boy may I tell you, St. James, Westmoreland and Clarendon are in active mayhem mood, especially Westmoreland. I tell you, right around the clock, people are getting killed left right and center in the parish of Westmoreland. Seriously, what go on in Westmoreland? Westmoreland need divine intervention. Now we head towards the parish of St. Elizabeth, the breadbasket of Jamaica, where this young lady allegedly committed suicide yesterday in a place called Silo where persons say it is called Windsor Bridge where she jumped off in a river and drowned in the river. Now it's alleged that it's a suicide took her own three points. Have you realized that for the past eight years to seven years Jamaicans have been taking their own life rapidly and it is so sad and many Jamaicans suffer from depression and they have no one to talk to even you know, if they talk to somebody the depression is so much that the only solution is to take his or her life and to be honest you know if you analyze it my viewers and my subscribers most of the victims are young people most of the victims are from age 16 to 50 they're the ones who are taking their life now we don't know what this young lady was going through but i am really really disheartened by this we not to know like this, this this is a tragic moment in Jamaica and for some reason the government and the people relatives family members they don't take suicide seriously whenever I know a person say that if you kill myself you know what Jamaicans say? I'm going to do it now. Go ahead now. Take your life now. Go on. Go on. Take your life. This is just an illiterate statement. Instead of being there for them, we encourage them more to take his or her own life. Instead of sitting down and say, listen, my friend. Listen, my partner my family member, my relative, my day I feel. Don't think about that. If you have troubles, if you have difficulties in life, please come and see me and I will help you in any way possible. Jamaicans will see their own relative a suffer and they don't even such a helping hand to help the relative. Instead, they help strangers. We cannot be like these people of Jamaica. I am sick and tired of seeing persons taking their own life. This is not good. It is not healthy. It is very, very, very tragic and sad and painful to the heart. I wonder you now if the government of Jamaica see this. Does Andrew Holness read the news and see what takes place in Jamaica? Or he's just dumb and blind to our Guan? Most times, you know, the persons who are taking their, their own life, they have relationship problems and financial difficulties. We need a suicide hotline. A group of callers dedicated to counseling persons 
who feel like taking their own life. The government of Jamaica need to invest in a suicide hotline. This is a serious warning to Jamaicans. It is time we put away our selfish ways and our pride and stop talking about this me, me, all about me and start thinking about us, we. Family members, if you have a relative that suffer from depression, me a big one. Check up on that relative. Go by where they live, call them, text them, remind them that you're there for them. And if they need anything, they can call or come to you. This time, the family members unite, relatives unite. We cannot allow these things to happen any longer. We're young people, Jamaicans overall, are taking their own life. It is wrong. It is not right in the sight of God. It is not. We have to create ways and other implementations of actually helping these persons or counseling these persons who are going through deep depression and have suicidal thoughts. Stop encouraging them to take their own life and please stop laughing at them. This is a serious matter in Jamaica. The suicide rate is on the rise in Jamaica and it's not pretty, not pretty at all. Now head towards the parish of Westmoreland, where yesterday a man who is known as Prince Charm or Bruce was shot and killed by criminal elements in a section of George's Plain, Westmoreland, which is called Water Lane. Now based on information, Bruce was in that community when he was approached by criminal elements. And he was shot several times before those criminals escaped successfully. The police were caught to the scene and arrival they saw Prince John lying in a pool of blood. Now so far there is no motive as to why he was killed. The police are investigating. Now in the parish of St. James, this morning a man who them call White Fox was stabbed dead by his ex-girlfriend during an altercation at the Montego Bay Transport Center this morning. Now, News on that is very sketchy, however, the next news broadcast, I give you full update as to what transpired. Now head towards the parish of Westmoreland once again. We are on the screen right now is businesswoman Lativa Simpson, aka Lati, who was shot and killed this morning by criminal elements on a motorcycle. Now based on information, this happened in Little London, Westmoreland, where Lativa Simpson arrived at her sports bar and restaurant to open business for the day when she was approached by gunmen on a motorcycle who asked her to give an ID of herself. Now Lati ran off but she was chased down by one of the criminal elements who shot her several times in her upper body. But thankfully, these gunmen did not escape. They have to abort the motorcycle and run in nearby bushes where they were chased by residents with machete and other weapons. One of the gunmen is now deceased. The next one was held by the police. Very unfortunate that this lady, age 39, Lativa Simpson, aka Lati, a businesswoman, an independent, gold driven woman, was killed based on a hit. Yeah, man, it's obvious that she was killed based on a hit placed on her life. 
May I tell the people, Westmoreland curse. Something serious is going on in Westmoreland that we cannot understand or fathom. Yeah, man. The criminals are out of control in Westmoreland. They are targeting innocent persons, other individuals, family members of criminal elements, and it goes on and on. Now still in the parish of Westmoreland, where this gun, a Taros 9M pistol, was seized in a little London community which is called Delviland. Now two persons were arrested during this seizure. Then I say to the police, job well once again. But Westmoreland is bleeding. Even though these firearms are being recovered, people are still being murdered in that parish. Now we head towards the parish of Clarendon in a place called Brian's Peace. Where on Sunday, a daughter to a life of her very own mother. Yeah, man. The daughter stabbed her mother multiple times. But now the daughter is in police custody. Now, based on information, the daughter is said to be mentally unstable. Now, this is the daughter you see on your screen right now. Them call her Kim. Now, based on information, around 2.30 p.m. yesterday afternoon, the mother and the daughter were at home where a dispute occurred. Now, during that dispute, Kim used a knife to inflict several wounds to the upper body of her mother. Now, her mother's name is Miss Mary Abut who is in her 60s. Now the police was caught to the scene on arrival. They found the mother lying in a pool of blood with several wounds, stab wounds to her body. Now later on, the daughter was arrested and now charged for the murder of her very own mother. Me I tell you. These things the Bible have spoke about. If you read Revelation, you won't be shocked of what is happening in our country, Jamaica, and around the world. We are living in the last days. So don't be shocked when you see these things are happening. This is Jay Crazy News once again with them. Have a blessed and safe Monday evening. Yeah man, I'm here to see a black legend. I'm here to represent for J Crazy YouTube reviewing channel. So watch, like, comment, subscribe, and share out the thing. J Crazy YouTube reviewing channel. In review news and entertainment. Celebrity lives that move them far through. J Crazy not play with him, I review the thing then. J Crazy YouTube reviewing channel. In review news and entertainment. Celebrity lives that move them far through. J Crazy not play with him, I review the thing then. Review the thing then, review the thing then Check crazy Reviewing news, entertainment and celebrity lifestyle Review the thing then, review the thing then Check crazy